I, I think the last decade was a lot of vertical integration, right? So you had companies like SpaceX, they're like, we can't just build the thrusters for rocket ship, right? We need like own from the nozzle all the way down, right? Yep. A fully vertigrated company or integrated company, sorry. I like vertigrated. I think vertigrated. we should start saying that. <laughs> this company has so much vertigo. Um, yeah. <laughs> and right now, what just, you know, this hasn't been planned out, but most of the compelling opportunities we've seen have been for kind of more horizontally integrated plays where like we just invest in a stat actuation. They have a novel electrostatic clutch design that is applicable to cars. Tell Stuart to come on the podcast. I will tell Stuart to come on the podcast. (laughs) Um, Cars, drones, robots, right? Things that need clutches that are lighter, that use less energy, that are more modular, right? That you can do more things with, but also things like power tools. Like it's it's a huge opportunity to replace and have safer, more effective power tools um, with their new clutch design. It's just these little plates that you apply electricity to and they can either grip or slip and they're really quite strong. Um, Other opportunities we've seen have been in the drug delivery space where people have a new method of delivering some therapy, um, but the drug delivery method itself could be its own therapy or have advanced materials applications, et cetera. Um, We've invested in um, new actuator designs, uh, torque limiters, different things that you're applicable across multiple industries 